F News presents Chapped Ass with President Donald J. Trump. One thing that chaps my ass, Twitter. Only 140 characters per tweet, that's not enough. Now I am, of course, a tremendous tweeter. Probably the best ever. People tell me that. They say that tremendous tweets. But to really do what the American people elected me to do, I need more. Many, many more letters, many, many more numbers, more of those little emojo things. I really like the rainbow ones. I would need at least 1,500 characters on Greta Van Susteren's facelift alone. Okay. Now back when I first had the idea for Twitter, not the name, just the idea, there was no character limit. That was put on there by Mark Zuckerberg or Bill Gates, one of those computer nerds. They thought it would stop me. But it isn't stopping me. If I have to humiliate myself 140 characters at a time, then that is what I will do. And by the way, Bill Gates is not richer than me. That's fake news. We all know that. Another thing that chaps my ass, ISIS claiming responsibility for every single bad thing that happens anywhere in the world. A nightclub explodes in Istanbul. Sure, I can see that. But last year, when Zoolander 2 first hit theaters, ISIS claimed responsibility for that. When Burger King first started serving those grilled hot dogs, disgusting, ISIS said it was their idea. Russell Crowe got tremendously fat. ISIS claimed to be responsible. It's an outrage. I say enough is enough. Enough is enough. Believe me, I will not allow these overrated terrorists take the blame for things they did not do. Now, Jonah Hill gets fat again. ISIS can take the credit for that. Because frankly, no one gives a damn. One more thing that chaps my ass, my very own Republican Party refusing to be more open-minded on this whole LGTV, BLT, sex identity thing. What I've come to realize is that trapped inside the body of this strong, smart, tremendously virile white man is a young, attractive, lower middle class black woman who chooses to go by the name Consuela Rodriguez. Do we have a few shots of Consuela? And Consuela will get tremendous approval ratings across every demographic. And she will be allowed to use every single restroom anywhere in this great country. And that includes the women's bathrooms at MSNBC and CNN, Mika Brzezinski, 
Anderson Cooper, you better watch your backs. I know you'll be in there. Okay? Anybody out there who doesn't like what they've just heard, including you Republicans, especially you, Paul Ryan, little dweeb, you can come right on over here to the White House right now and bring with you some lotion and rub it on my very chapped, tremendously chapped presidential ass, very, very chapped ass. It'll be right here waiting for you when you arrive. Thank you and God bless America.